Um, hi, Aniki. Good, uh, good morning. I have good news for you. We just um, found out the results of the complaints process. Um, thank you. So what happened was uh, Beth got uh, fired from what she did to you. It was proven. She deserved that. Yeah. yeah, I'm really sorry I'm about so that. Uh, because for, from, for until from, now, the mark of my, you know, so hurt, hurting, she hurt him a lot. Not, not in physical, also emotional. I'm really yeah. sorry that this happened to you in our facility. This is not... Uh, uh, acceptable uh, behavior so I will tell you all the things that what we're gonna do moving on so and um, Beth has already been uh, it was from the investigation all the allegations were proven so she got fired uh, stood down from her job and it was this was very surprising because we found out as well that this happened already before. She was also oh, stood down from really? her previous uh, job in working with disabled clients. She also Bad had an yeah, assault yeah. charge. So the person in charge of the investigation uh, is already, uh, uh, Beth is already being uh, taken care of. So she's going to uh, have cases filed against her is she for assault. Deal? She might if she loses the case. Uh, against that but for what we can do in the facility she's already out of service so you don't have to deal with her anymore mm -hmm. and Thanks from you. this experience that this happened uh, we changed the, some of the rules and we made it more clear that this type of behavior is not acceptable in the aged care facility and uh, we'll do refresher trainings for all the carers and how they should support hand, uh, handling um, uh, transferring and also uh, taking care of your clients personal care how to do it the proper way the correct way and yeah the code of conduct is gonna be revised and all staff uh, will be will hopefully treat you better in the following days yeah. how, how is the staff treating uh, you now he's good now he's good now oh that's very good to yeah. hear and um, like Beth. And I, I did hear from you last time that you felt traumatized. So is, is that correct? Yeah. Correct. Yeah, you did. Until now, yeah. You, you, till now. Yeah. So, uh, we're gonna set but you up with a counseling, uh, uh, psychological issues that you may have, like you would have uh, yes. counseling and uh, My, uh, therapy yeah. for that. It helps me, I think. Yeah, and uh, the rostering of the staff is also going to be. Uh, we'll make sure that there's uh, staff have sufficient time to do their jobs properly like maybe what happened in the past was they had to rush because they had to take care of many more clients so uh, we'll make sure we'll allocate more time and uh, for the staffs to do things properly and um, so are you happy with the outcomes of the investigation yes very happy but i st still have a trauma every time sometimes every time the care worker comes to me i'm afraid sometimes because i i, I can see the piece of bed yeah okay okay yeah the the there will be uh this yeah i was what i've talked about the psychological uh you will meet with a professional who will uh yeah. Thank you. do therapy with you and uh, if, if there are other services that needs uh, like for example yeah such as that uh, we will we'll assist you in getting those services and if uh, any more improvements that needs to be uh, uh, be done we'll, we'll do it thank you that's it. Thank you, sir. Okay, it's good to see you, Aniki. Thank you, sir. Have a good day. Mm -hmm.